Hi, I'm Richard Prentice. I'm Applications Engineer for Texas Instruments High Speed Data Converter Products. And today we're going to be demonstrating the setup and use of our new low cost uh, suite of tools, our High Speed Data Converter System Evaluation Kit. This is our High Speed Data Converter System Evaluation Kit set up around our ADS4249 uh, A to D EVM. Uh, for our analog input we have our TSW2110, it's a highly filtered 10 megahertz sine wave and it has a fixed 10 dBm power output which into a 50 ohm load is approximately 2 volt peak to peak so that sets it at about a dB or 2 down from full scale input of the data converter under test for the clock source, we have our TSW4806 clock generator module. It is built around the LMK4806 clock chip, and it is set up by default to provide a 245.76 megahertz uh, highly filtered clock to the data converter. It has an optional GUI through a USB port that it can be programmed for different uh, frequencies if needed. For the power source we have our TSW2200 which for convenience powers off a standard laptop brick, a 19 volt laptop brick. It has 5 volt outputs, 3.3, 1.8, a fixed negative voltage and several adjustable voltages which at the moment we're powering 5 volt to the device under test and 5 volt to the clock source and sine wave source. For data capture we have our TSW1405 capture card. It is powered off of the USB connection from the laptop and the internal memory on the 1405 is deep enough to capture uh, as much as 64K samples or 65536 samples of data from the data converter and that is uploaded to the PC for analysis. So let's power on our system evaluation kit and now I'm going to go over to the PC and launch the High Speed Data Converter Pro uh, Capture Card GUI and the first thing it's going to do is find the USB connection to the TSW1405 so I will accept that and now I go over and select the device under test which is going to be the ADS4249 and it will prompt me do I want to update the firmware to the capture card for this specific evaluation module which I do so it is loading the capture card firmware it has done that now I enter my sample frequency which is 245.76 capital M for megahertz and my analog input frequency which in this case is 10 capital M megahertz and I'm capturing uh, 32768 32k samples of data so I am ready to press capture and the capture card has loaded in uh, 32768 samples of data from the data converter and the first uh, window, the first display is the frequency domain. So here's the FFT. You can see the 10 megahertz fundamental with the harmonic, second, third, fourth, fifth harmonic. The performance metrics are over on the left here. Uh, in this case I got a signal noise ratio of 70.3 dB full scale and a spurious free dynamic range of about 84 dBc. So 84 dB from the input tone down to the worst spur which is in this case the second harmonic. So as you can see we just performed a uh, evaluation of the ADS4249 using the high speed data converter system evaluation kit and no expensive lab equipment was needed and both the system evaluation kit and all of the individual components can be found on TI.com and that wraps up the demonstration of the system evaluation kit.